So the first stop is off the beaten track a little bit. It's called Rover Bagel, and it's tucked in the old mill buildings in Biddeford. We bake them at a high heat in a wood-fired oven. Husband and wife team Alec and Kim Rudder started a small pop-up in Salem, Mass, where Kim is from, and then they moved to Maine, where Alec grew up. They've been turning out bagels for five years. What was it like to be named one of the best bagel makers in America? It was a bit of a shock. I mean, it's pretty incredible uh, to be named among a bunch of people that we respect a bunch and, and really look up to. And you have to try the lime, lemon, and honey-flavored cream cheese to go with your Rover bagel. Mine had cranberries baked in. And customers keep coming back. Their whole, I think their theme is like, looks weird, tastes great sort of thing. How about this? Even before COVID and social distancing, there's always been a line outside Scratch Baking in Willard Square in South Portland, where customers don't mind waiting for their delicious, straight out of the oven bagels. The owner says after 17 years in business, to be named among the best in America? Yes, it's a huge honor. What's their secret? Um, I think the secret to our bagels, one is our sourdough starter that we use in them, and we put a lot of effort and patience and love into them. Our third and final stop, Forage, which began in Lewiston, branched out in Portland's Monjoy Hill neighborhood. No one else does bagels in a turntable oven like this that we know of. Here you'll find a custom-made wood-fired oven that rotates during the baking process. It blisters the bagels and that direct heat gives them a lot of character and flavor. Food and Wine magazine said of the Forage bagel, gorgeously light and beautifully structured with an exterior that snaps and crackles like popcorn. We're always looking for something new, interesting, and delicious. If you know of a place, let me know. Email me at the Jim Keithley WMTW Facebook page, and we'll see you next time.